What is up YouTube? Degenerate Collector coming to you today from Greenville, North Carolina. Gonna check out the Roses Express, see what they've got toy-wise since the Christmas holiday season's coming up. So come with me and let's do this. All right, so for you guys that don't know what a Roses is, they used to be like a Target and a Walmart back in the day. But now they're more like a, a Ollie's. Second time I've done this, please use the other door. I did this the other day at Ollie's, but let's go inside. I don't know if you guys out west or up north have a little Debbie. I think you guys got Tasty Cake, but around here we have little Debbie and they are absolutely delicious all right here is the the christmas stuff santa claus another santa claus in a flannel shirt we just saw one of those the other day at ollie's a bigger one a big old reindeer all right they also have a little mini electronic section nothing compared to walmart or target but i'm gonna let you see a little bit of what they've got this is kind of like an old uh 70s or 80s old uh Tune in and listen, transistor radio, GPS holder for your phone or a GPS device. Me being a kid from back in the, the 80s and 90s, we used to call these rabbit ears. You could put aluminum foil on them and, and pick up channels from 40, 50, 60 miles down the road. This is the more modern antenna, the HDTV, multi-directional. And they sell a few TVs, but nothing really big. All right, guys, this one I'm talking about is kind of, kind of mainly like uh, it's like somebody already took the dart blaster. That's, that's MIA. It's missing an action. A neon green, uh, excuse me, neon orange. Damn colorblind there for a minute. Neon orange army rifle. Okay, can somebody? Please tell me what's wrong with this. If this is an army rifle, shouldn't it be camouflaged so the enemy doesn't see you coming instead of being bright damn orange? That's that's kind of kind of stupid, right? Here's a uh cap gun. I think I think they've started banning cap guns. I don't see them anymore. I used to see them at the dollar dollar stores all the time. Make it rain with the fake money instead of Barbie. At Roses, you get a Stacy doll. Look at this, this, this short, the WWF LJN stretch wrestlers, but here's a, a stretchy wrestler nonetheless. And here's the, the fake Hulk Hogan. I guess this is the, uh, I don't know, fake Zeus or fake Abdul of the Butcher. Kind of looks like a, a Abdul of the Butcher. Squishy monsters. You can get your kid a axe throwing kit because that's what you want. You want to teach your kids to throw axes at your head. And we found Mr. Potato Head Chips. This is when he was, he was still Mr. Potato Head. We got, I don't even know what PJ Masks is. I don't know what PJ Mask is, but... This is how I look being a PJ mask. Right, we got some official U.S. Army walkie-talkies. Jurassic World matchbox. This is probably about the coolest thing I've seen in here so far. What is this SpongeBob? I swear, guys, I don't know what some of this stuff is. This this looks old. I guess this is kind of like paper dolls. This is a uh, Frozen 2 wooden dolls. The world's smallest wrestling figures. Here is Sasha Banks, Finn Balor, Seth Rollins, AJ Styles with the short hair. Oh my God, Kalisto. I don't think Kalisto's even been with the company for over three or four years now. KO, Kevin Owens. And another Seth Rollins. Some Hot Wheels and... Oh, 
another stretchy guy. This is Manny Fernandez, the Raging Bull. I've never seen these before. These are, these are. I thought they were knockoffs at first, but these are official GI Joes. Here's a Duke. No articulation really, but about about seven inches. And we got a uh, Snake Eyes back there. And we got Storm Shadow. Oh, look at this. This is a uh, a fake Transformers set. Dino Robot, but ironically enough, right beside it is the original Transformers, as well as Transformers Squeezelings. Lots of uh, KO knockoff Lego style kits. Oh, wait a minute, we got full size Mattel Basic wrestling figures. Finn Balor. Oh my god, look at that. Look at the face. That's that's pretty bad. The Undertaker on a motorcycle. That's actually pretty cool. And continuing on with the fake Barbies, we got Hallie Jr. Victoria. This this has to be part of the Barbie line because this oh, that's a damn good knockoff. I don't think Sophia is in Barbie, but yeah, it's not. It's it's not Mattel. But damn the. The text on the logo looks almost just like Mattel's Barbie. Some uh, styling heads. My sister used to have these things when she was a kid. She had the, the big Barbie one. Now they have some Marvel. There's the Black Panther and all Black Panthers it looks like and Captain America's and here is Jar Jar Binks from Star Wars. If I dig through here and we find the Mandalorian I'm gonna scream. Nope. All just Jar Jar Binks. Dude, I actually escaped coming in a store today and not seeing the child from The Mandalorian. Can you believe it? I can't. Okay, we just saw this at, at the Nostalgia Newsstand the other day. This is the, the Harley Quinn figure I was talking about because the King Shark part was bigger than the actual figure. It looks like they've got the Peacemaker, which is of course John Cena. And they put $14.99 over his face so you can't see him. And there's the arms to the King Shark. And if you get... Who the hell is Polka Dot Man? You get the head and the torso, I guess, if you buy Polka Dot Man. If you guys know who Polka Dot Man is, please leave it in the comments below and let me know who Polka Dot Man is. Because I'm not familiar with Polka Dot Man. Oh, there's... There's John Cena. We can see you now. And looks like we found the the real Barbies. Here's Barbie as a boxer. Barbie as a fire firewoman. Barbie as a school teacher. And I guess Safari Barbie. Dude, if I had 50 cent, I would so play this. This this looks so 80s right here. Look at that. Ninja Wall Walkers. All right, guys, so if you've never seen a Roses, that was Roses. Roses Express, like I say, they used to be a big retail store back in the 80s, early 90s. They competed with Target and Walmart, but how the mighty have fallen, so that was their little toy section. I did get some pickups today, so I'm going to show you guys what I got. You cannot believe what I found at Roses. So look at this, an ultra rare... 30 count styrofoam plates. Do you know how fucking rare that is? 30 count styrofoam plates. I'm gonna use it for Thanksgiving. The sarcasm I hope is not lost on all of you. Another cool pickup for today. Assorted plastic utensils. We get, in this package we get 51 pieces. It's spoons, forks, and knives. We also get Look at this, 45 count styrofoam drinking cups. And the plates were on sale two for a dollar. This is probably gonna be my snack for today. A Hershey's Symphony Bar. Oh wait, there's more, there's more. Almond Joy, because Almond Joy has nuts and mouths don't. All right guys, so if you enjoyed this video, 
be sure to smash that like button, subscribe to the channel, leave comments below, let me know what you'd like to see on this channel, like, comment, subscribe, all that good shit, and until next time, I'm going to keep trying to figure it out.